Perry and Upper Scioto Valley sport the last two unbeaten conference records in the Northwest Central Conference. The winner tonight between the Rams and the Commodores would have sole possession of first place. You can catch this game after the show tonight, so grab some TJ's Pizza if you want to be surprised by the outcome. First quarter we go, Chaz Jackson. He had a big game tonight. He pull up and hit the J just past the foul line. Perry draws first blood. Later on, scores 5-3 in Jackson, but shoot from the same spot and the same result. Perry now up by four. And Rams are trying to get moving now. Jackson roars, knocks down the three ball, 7-6 Perry. And shortly after, Hurley finds Sanders open, and he scores down low. USV is still trailing by one, 64-54. Perry with a big win tonight. Here's head coach after the victory. It boosts me up to come out and compete even harder and then get my teammates involved and just do what we do. Well, I think the biggest key was us changing defenses. We went to a little 1-3-1 one, one, and we gave them a little 3-2 uh, half court and it kind of threw them for a wrench. But, uh, you know, one of our assistants brought up a good thing in the locker room that uh, you don't know when your number is going to be called. Uh, someone like a Jeffrey Simpson who it's a big basket for us to beat LCC and then tonight, a kid that's been playing JV all year, Joey Hurston, gets a gets a three-pointer, you know, that kind of kick-started our fourth quarter. And so, um, but I think, again, it goes back to us changing defenses and our kids trusting us and uh, just doing what they were supposed to do and making enough plays. And that actually got our, our running game going tonight and because uh, we were kind of stagnant against their zone. So we needed to find a way to get the ball, and uh, that's what we did with the change of defense.